there is an alternate universe where a rebellion is taking place. The force of good against an evil ruler. There are five ordinary kids on Earth who must stand united, who must fight this evil, and who must win. trashed my room. What's wrong with me? It's not one of those becoming a woman things, is it? Hey, Lynn. You're just a growing girl. Say, why not invite some friends over for an after-school snack? <gasps> What's in there? Oh, 
Christmas present. Don't look. What are you giving me? A bear with a spotlight? Oh, you could invite Cornelia and uh, Tarani and oh, that funny girl Irma. Sure. And that new girl Will. Uh, I wonder why I thought of her. Ooh. Uh. Don't forget, make lots of new friends today. I put a dozen extra cookies in your lunch to help break the ice with the other girls. Gee, that'll make me popular. Too much fertilizer reverses osmosis, killing the plants. Yours has grown like three inches. Well, I tried to kill it. I fertilized its little butt off. <gasps> the judge. <gasps> oh, great. You and your little girly fists are gonna cost us a ribbon. Oh. Hey, check out the new girl. Hey, Wilma. Uh, it's just Will. Okay, Wilma. <laughs> That's Uriah. Ignore him. Yeah, evolution did. One day we expect him to slither back into the water. Oh, hey, Lynn, I got your note. Thanks so much for the invitation. So, what time are we eating? She invited New Girl, too? Cornelia? <gasps> Want a cookie? The antelope has escaped the main guard. We suspect they'll head for the mountains. The more success the rebels have, the more it emboldens the peasants to rise up. This is too important to leave to guards. Yes, my prince. Where did you go to school before Sheffield? Hello? Who cares? Have you guys noticed a bunch of real strange stuff going on around me lately? <gasps> oh dear! The conversation has accidentally wandered away from Cornelia's life. Whatever were we thinking? Mm. <laughs> Enjoying your food? Thanks. Oh, yeah. thanks. Yeah, thanks. yeah I appreciate thanks. it. A lot of things. But the important thing is, how is Cornelia enjoying her food? <laughs> <clears throat> 
you will make a new best friend. What's in the box, Grandma? Oh, ha, ha. excuse me. Let me tell you girls a story that I believe will have a special meaning for all five of you. Grandma, they really don't want to hear a story. Shh. The universe was once a single kingdom ruled by good, but evil began to take root. A veil was created to isolate the evil kingdom of Meridian from all other worlds. Without the protection of this veil, every world, including Earth, is in terrible danger. Meridian has been overtaken by a powerful entity named Phobos. But he is not the legitimate ruler. They believe the true heir to the throne is somewhere here on Earth. Um, I'd like to wake up now. But portals have begun to open in the veil. Doorways through which evil can cross between worlds. There are people called guardians, whose job it is to close these holes using their powers. I became a guardian when I was your age. But now the duty is passing to your generation. Well, thanks for the snacks. Ah, 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 ah. This is the heart of Kandrakar, which contains the elementary forces of nature. In the last few days, you have all had unusual experiences. Am I right? Not counting this one? All five of you are starting to notice extraordinary abilities. Irma, you will have noticed any water near you behaving strangely. Ah. Whoa. Whoa! Okay. Alrighty. Tehrani, I believe you've always been afraid of fire. But focus now on the candle. <gasps> My little Halion, this morning you noticed your power over air. <sighs> to you, Cornelia, is given the power over Earth. All five of you will get better with your powers. I hope. Uh, did you say five? Um, hate to disappoint you, but I can't even do that trick where it looks like your thumb comes apart. But if I ever have a party, you guys are definitely the entertainment. One of the five binds the others, and with the heart of Kandrakar, unites them, summoning and magnifying their powers. We've got to protect the world from evil by repairing holes in some kind of veil. This doesn't involve sewing, does it? This is so cool! When can we start? You already have. Why tell us all this now, Grandma? There is a rebellion in Meridian, but their leader is in danger. I fear a dark and difficult time is coming. Many good people will need your help. Will, Irma, Tarani, Cornelia, Halin. You have been chosen as the new Guardians of the Veil. Sorry. It's too weird. I can't. Interesting. Walk faster than this. Thanks for the ride. How much do I owe you? Uh, the Infinite City is still an hour's walk, Caleb. 
For you, I'm not going. What? I heard something from my informant. Phobos has discovered the rightful heir to the throne is alive on Earth. Earth? I need to find a portal. If we don't locate the heir before Phobos does, Meridian and Earth are both doomed. Tell the men to stay strong and the women not to worry. I hope to see you soon, Eldarn. don't believe any of this stuff. No offense to your grandma or anything, but she's like completely deluded. Probably not enough vitamin D. What about the flower that grew when you just looked at it? And the water in Irma's glass? And that picture Mrs. Lynn drew in the air? Magic tricks. Ten bucks on the internet. You know, somehow I cannot imagine your grandma wearing that. What have we got behind us? What have we got in front of us? <laughs> <laughs> They're wings! We've got wings! They can't be wings. If they were wings when we went like this, we'd... <gasps> Man, I hate heights. I get woozy in high heel shoes. What? <laughs> oh, does anyone have a camera? Or one of those cell phones? Oh. <laughs> This totally sucks! You do something! <gasps> See? That's exactly why I told you I'd fire! Irma, your water put it out! <gasps> Irma? Oh, poo! There's no soil or plants here. I can't do my thing. Like, you know, rise towards me or whatever. It's getting late. I think we've destroyed enough of Heatherfield for today. Where did he live go? Founder! Anytime. I really think you ought to check this out. Check what out? <gasps> What's that? Don't touch it! Go! <laughs> Will, the necklace! Take us back!
close the portal! Oh! The thingy! Use the crystal! That thing got him! I see. What did he look like? I don't know. He was just a boy. It happened so fast. Don't blame yourselves. I don't. I blame her. She totally blew it. Hey, take it easy, Corny. No, you take it easy, Ermy. Guys! It looked like this. Oh, Lord Cedric. Lord, they got pretty low standards for knighthood over there. Cedric is not always in this form. Well, that's good news for his wife. Irma, this is serious. I know. You think I'm not scared? Ah, uh, uh, don't fight. You only have each other, and you've begun an adventure, which I'm afraid you will need all of your talents and strength just to survive. Finding her is essential if I'm to maintain my power over Meridian. The troublemaker, Prince Phobos. You will tell us the names of your fellow traitors in the Rebellion. You'll learn nothing from me! You won't be so obstinate after the Rebellion. Boy, I wonder who he was. Oh, I wonder what that thing did to him. It's what it could have done to us that worries me. I mean, that's what we're supposed to fight with our so-called powers? I am sorry, but I am far too pretty to end up as snake poo. <laughs> <laughs> It's class picture day tomorrow. Do you guys get dressed up? What? what? Oh, no. What no way. Cornelia started shopping for you in the kindergarten. I wonder where that boy is now. Eternity in the Oubliette suits you, traitor. Fight this long for freedom to perish in a hole with a talking pickle. Pickle! <laughs> I saw the new guardians. It looks like a long wait to get rescued. I'll have to get out of here myself. Something he said. 
You're mostly out of here, aren't you? <laughs> yes, I am. <laughs> uh, I've been in tougher places than this. Okay, not smell your places. Too high. Never make it. Have you even tried? Ah! 3,700 times. Ah! 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 <laughs> Keep it. I don't plan to still be here for dinner. Prince Phobos, we've located a portal. Use it to bring me this girl. Slow down, Tinkerbell. Okay, we can rescue this rebel leader guy after picture day, right? Call me a wimp, but in the school yearbook, I'd like to still have a face. Forget picture day. I don't care what I look like. I care about who I am. Let's go kick some Meridian butt! Maybe there'll be some cute evil boys over there, like the one that mm, snake thing caught. Mm. I want to go, but I don't know how much help we're going to be by soaking him and covering him with garbage. Let's practice again tomorrow. Trani, don't you go this way? My dad's cooking tonight. <laughs> I'm going to Irma's place. See you tomorrow, Will. Um, so you really aren't getting dressed up for your pictures? <laughs> yeah, right. Like there's going to be any clothes or makeup left in the world after Cornelia's finished? Hello? <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> you hypocrites! Uh, what? What do you mean, what? Oh, I don't care what I look like. I care about who I am. Nice shoes. Are you going to the land of Oz after school? Like you didn't dress up. Well, we all knew I was lying. Oh, when he comes in, I get dizzy in high heels. Oh, oh. Is that for your cape and tiara? It's Will's backpack. I found it lying on the sidewalk. The crystal's still in it. Well, maybe she just dropped it and didn't notice? Get real. Her science textbook alone must weigh 20 pounds. Is the heart of Kantrakar? I don't know. We've got to go get her. You're serious? You want to skip school on picture day? Hello. Will's been seized by the forces of evil. We don't know that. Huh? We don't even know how to find her. Um, we uh, may not know, but this thing seems to have an idea. You know, I liked it better when I couldn't see it. <laughs> so this is where they store all the world's dust. What? Wheels on the other side of that? This is crazy. Until she puts that on, we don't have any power. We're taking the word of what? Some jewelry to save a person we hardly know? Cornelia, her name is Will, and she's in horrible danger. Yeah, last year I was the new girl. I like her. She's funny and smart. Look, you don't have to come if you don't want to. <sighs> okay, guilt me, why don't you? But no way I'm going first. Chicken out. Well, I won't. I'll go last. Then you have to do something. What do I have to do? Push me. My pleasure. I'm gonna have to trust you. Trust Blank. Yes. Put your foot or hoof or whatever it is in here. When I count to three, jump as high as you can. I'm gonna throw you out and then one, two, listen. And you're gonna find a rope and lower it to me. Rope. Yes. Good plan. No. Terrible plan. But even if you betray me, at least it'll smell better down here. One, two, three! <laughs> no, 
<laughs> Sorry, let's try again. <laughs> That's right, Guardian of the Veil. You're going down there with the rebel leader. You're the kid from yesterday. You're not one of the guardians I saw. Where's your older sister? Wait, you're the rebel leader I'm supposed to be saving? What are you rebelling against, diaper rash? Hey, girly girl, I'm 15. Never mind that. Activate the crystal and fly us out of here. I didn't exactly bring it. You didn't exactly bring it? Why catch her, not catch me? <laughs> He's harmless, I think. He's just a smuggler. Discount importer! Huh, you know, I was wrong. I should go last. No, you're right. I should push you. Ah! Ah! No! Gross, 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 gross! With your eyes bugged out like that, you look just like a frog. Keep it down, you guys. All of evil's gonna hear you. I got no signal here. Uh, you might want to move away from me. I am getting tired of people yeah! telling me what to do. <laughs> that certainly wakes up your underwear. <laughs> Cornelia, don't look down. That's for heights, you dipwit. I know, but if you see your reflection, you'll like completely freak. <laughs> ah, look, it's simple. You stand on my shoulders, then he stands on your shoulders. Not until he's had a nine-month bath, he doesn't. Girls, I need a rope, some kind of weapon, and what do I get? A short redhead with attitude. Hey, I'm a guardian of the veil, buddy. You're just some guy at the bottom of a hole. He do this? Don't put foot, big hurt. idea. Oh, don't look so surprised. other guardians. Well, of course. 
course, silly. What are you doing up there? Be right. Cornelia, Tarani, block the stairs. Hey, Lynn, find us an exit. Rebel leader's down there. He's too heavy to lift out. His mouth alone must be 200 pounds. We don't have to lift him. Water! not going to hold for very long. What is that? We're <laughs> finding cute boys. <gasps> There's a million halls down there. It's like this really cool maze. I mean, cool if we weren't like, you know, trapped in here and everything. <gasps> hey, you didn't get eaten by that thing. Take Blank, Blank knows tunnel. Secret way out. <laughs> He's kind of cute. Trusting a smuggler. Oh, uh, who are you again? He's the rebel leader. You're the rebel leader? Yeah. I'll hold them off as long as I can. No, you don't have any powers. Guarding the veil's more important than one rebel fighter. Oh, by the way, my name's Caleb. Is he cute? What? Hey, snake face! fly better than you. Be careful. Come on, come on. I make a purse out of you. Purse out. Which side you want the side. zipper on? The zipper on.
you believe what we just did? That was so unreal. Talk about teamwork. What happened to your face? When we swung across the moat, Cornelia George of the Jungle into the wall. Wham! <laughs> What dangers are in this place? Well, there's the cafeteria food. It was so great! We fought and we flew, and this slime old creepo thing escaped into the pipes. You think he'll be okay in there? If he comes up under the girls' locker room, I'm switching school. It was intense. Ooh! And look what I figured out our initial spell. The main thing is, the bad guy didn't get our new best friend. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Prince Phobos didn't want Will. What? That's crazy. What? Only her power. I fear he wants another, whose battle is yet to come.